Hi everyone, Roblox Dad here, and today I want to show you what happened a few days ago in a public server in Adopt Me, and how my friend Lincoln Park Fan 2002 was scammed out of a legendary pet. Now, there were two people involved in this scamming operation. The one's name was Kenneth Oglet, spelled O G L I T, and the other's name is the underscore tutorialists. Now you can find their names at the beginning of this video. They had been conspiring to troll and scam people. Now I hadn't been paying attention to the comments and actually you could see I have a woodland egg. So what I was doing is I was recording with my OBS software in the hopes that I would record myself hatching one of these eggs into a deer or a hawk. But what I actually did catch is I did catch this whole operation and recorded all these comments. Now, I recorded like 40 minutes worth, so I did have to edit it down. I'm not going to play all 40 minutes, of course. But I just want to show you the highlights, and I want to show you what they were doing so you guys can protect yourselves and you could not fall victim to this scam if you see somebody doing this in the comments in the future uh, whether it be these two or somebody else now let me make the comments bigger hold on okay i'll zoom in now you can see what the tutorialist is saying abc to trust trade they're saying i'm not going first somebody's calling them a scammer i swear to the mother of god it's not a scam but then they say this is all my scammed pets i trust traded then they say it again. No, it's my scammed pets. So on one hand, they're saying they're not a scammer, but then they're saying they have scammed pets. Again, there they go, saying they're not scamming. Swearing again that they're not scamming. And again, not scamming. So you see what's going on here. So they keep saying they're not scamming. So here we go again. ABC to trust trade, not going first, want to trust trade. So then this person, Kenneth, says, bro, don't come at me with that scammy stuff. The tutorialist is then replying that they're not scamming, asking again, you know, to trust trade later on. You know, Kenneth is saying that he doesn't trust this. He doesn't trust some people making trades. So then the tutorialist says, ask again about trading. Uh, Kenneth agrees. But then look at this. He says, let's troll people. And then the tutorialist says, yeah. So... Then the tutorialist says, wait, so I believe they were talking in private chat. The tutorialist says again, ABC to trust trade. And Kenneth says, ABC, me, me. And then look what happens. The tutorialist says they scammed Kenneth. They start laughing at him, calling him, call him a noob. And then Kenneth goes, no. You know, then Kenneth is saying, why you scam me? And then the tutorialist is saying he fell for that. So you could you could pause and read all this stuff if you wanted to. Go back and read it. And so they keep going back and forth. Kenneth is saying he got scammed. The tutorialist is laughing, saying he scammed him out of his neon frog. And, you know, well, how did you fall for that? And now he's asking for help. Kenneth is saying, guys, help me. He scammed me out of my best pet. So this is the point where I saw what was going on here. So I went ahead and I told my friend about what was going on. So we both made a report against the tutorialists for scamming. Now you could pause this, go back and pause and read what I wrote. Um, so now the tutorialist is saying, uh, you know, hey, if you guys have a pet, you give them a pet to make up for the one the tutorialist took. Here, Kenneth is saying again, he took my neon frog. Now my friend is looking for Kenneth in the game and we're both thinking about what pets we could give him to try to make up for the one that he lost. 
Here again, the tutorial says, give him a pet yourself. I already scammed these many pets. Now, we both missed Kenneth's comment earlier about let's troll people. So, we felt bad. So, here the tutorial again says, all my scammed pets. Kenneth goes, what? What? So, it's at this point where my friend gave him the crow. See where he says, free crow, no way. Then... He goes again, not freaking way. And she smiles. Tutorialist goes, no way, no way. And then the tutorialist says, wait, take the frog. Kenneth says, uh, no. And then the tutorialist says, no, I want my neon frog. Kenneth goes, what just happened? Thank you so very much, 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 much. My friend says, you're welcome. Then she says, be careful of scammers, and he goes, thank you. So then the tutorialist comes and says, want to know something? Kenneth goes, trading crow. The says, I didn't actually scam this frog. We pranked you into scamming a frog, laugh out loud. OMG, we got such a smart idea. Kenneth goes, OMG, I still can't believe I got my dream pet for free. Tutorialist is like, OMG, laugh out loud, Kenneth, Kenneth, teleport to me. The tutorialist says, Kenneth, I'm happy you got a crow. So now this is all out in the open. This scam has been exposed by them. Kenneth goes, no, thank you, tutorial. So they must have been talking in private chat or something. Then the tutorialist goes, Kenneth, Kenneth has a, puts a question mark. And then the tutorialist says, we actually did it. So they're talking about their scam, that they actually pulled it off. Kenneth goes, yeah. The tutorialist goes, we pranked them into scamming a neon. Laugh out loud. Tutorialist goes, I'm laughing so much right now. So I'm thinking there was another person that gave Kenneth a neon. So they scammed somebody else. Then Kenneth goes, yeah, she gave it to for free thinking I was actually scammed. Kenneth says, this is the best day ever. So they're happy about this. They're proud of this. They're really proud of themselves. Then Kenneth goes, block her, man. So it's at this point that I reported Kenneth for scamming. Now you can go back, pause the video, and see everything I wrote. Then Kenneth goes, that's my bro. He ain't trying to be suspect. So Kenneth is defending the tutorialist because the tutorialist is trying to do another uh, trade slash scam. Kenneth goes, yo, I blocked her. So they scam people out of their pets and then they turn around and they block them because my friend got blocked also after this happened. So I just wanted to get this out there because I wanted you guys to see what's going on and I want you to be safe playing Adopt Me and uh, playing on Roblox. My friend was so disheartened after this had happened that she just, her, her heart just sunk. Because she's the type of person that she will go into a game and she'll look for people to give pets to. You know, people that actually need pets. Maybe they're just starting out and they don't have any. Or they only have a couple pets. So she will go give them a pet. Sometimes she just gives it to them and she runs away. So if this kid had asked for a pet, this Kenneth, she would have given him a pet. But no, he scammed it. Him and the tutorialist, they both came up with this plan. I think uh, it might have been more the tutorialist because that person's been on Roblox a lot longer. They came up with this plan to scam people. I think they should both be banned from Adopt Me permanently. But that's not up to me. I hope you guys are having a blessed day and a blessed night wherever you're at. I hope this video helped you. If it's going to help you to not get scammed in the future, please squish the like button. And please subscribe to my channel. And also hit the bell button. That way you'll get notified when I put out more videos.
Okay? All right. Take care. All right. Bye-bye.